Hey guys, it's Katie at scrappingkatie.ctmh.com and I am sharing days 9 and um, kind of 10 for the 2019 Days of December album from Close to My Heart. So here's a look at the pages and if you can tell, uh, day 10 is missing. So I pulled out my box and I'm going to grab the envelope for the, this two page layout as well as my instructions. And I've gone ahead and I've printed the photos um, nine was a very eventful day for our older son and 10 was not really eventful. So I decided to um, forego day 10. At this point right here, I'm really not sure about that yet. So I'm going to go ahead and ink up the nine and then get that cleaned off and then grab the 10 and ink it up as well in my intense black ink from close to my heart. And the reason I'm using intense black is because I'm going to use that technique again of using my sh red shimmer brush to color over those numbers just to add some color. I hope you can see the shimmer here in just a second. It just adds just a delicate uh, shimmer, glitter, just a little bit of something that those numbers need. Also, I'm gonna be using two holly sprigs, and so I have pulled off the holly leaves, and I'm going to ink those up in green apple. And I love that the thin cuts match perfectly with the stamped images. And then being that Close My Heart's uh, stamps are clear as well as that acrylic block, I can see exactly where to put those holly berries as well as the leaves. And so I'm going to pack everything up and then start assembling that page nine. So everything's going to go on here. Originally, um... I wanted to do a five by seven photo, but I decided to go with the pre-designed layout of a four by six. And so I'm going to adhere everything down. I really hate to hide all this adorable um, Christmas paper background and texture. Um, it's black and then it's got little bitty tiny white Christmas trees everywhere. So also per the pre-designed layout, um, Close to My Heart has added three of the green apple enamel dots from the Holly Jolly collection. And so again, I really wanted to use that big five by seven photo, but I just thought, you know, I'm going to use that for one of the smaller photo wells. And then I'm just going to trim down this photo so it will fit in that four by six slot. So because I uh, did not turn off um, the borderless printing um, on my printer, I had to kind of crop this down more than I wanted to. And so that white space at the bottom, I've decided to cover it up with the border stamp that comes with the Days of December uh, stamp set and ink it up in green apple and just stamp it around um, across the bottom of that photo. And then I'm going to put the number nine there for the ninth day of December. And then I'm going to use thin 3D foam adhesive to adhere that holly sprig on there. And I've decided to do it on the inside of the number nine. So for day 10, um, it's still at this point, I'm thinking I'm going to um, slide a day 10 in there. So I've laid out the, the uh, three by four uh, Project My Life cards, which is close to my heart's equivalent to pocket scrapbooking, as well as a couple of photo wells. One is for a three by four photo. So I've trimmed that photo of my son and his girlfriend down just a tad. And then there's a three by three photo. So I've trimmed down a picture of a new oven that we're having to purchase. Thinking that I would do that. And here is where I've decided um, I'm not going to do day 10. You know, that's the good thing about the days of December. Um, they're my days of December. And while we purchased an oven on the 10th, we're not actually going to install it until later. So I'm just going to document that and then really document this special occasion in my son and his girlfriend's life. Um, they got to attend the White House Christmas party. So politics aside, um, whether you're a fan or not, that is um, a very special event for them. And so I really wanted to document it. So here I've pulled out my album, um, the page protectors that these will go in. I find it's easier to insert those while the page protectors are out of the album. So I'm just going to do that. Um, as you can see, I replaced that Santa's list with the comfy and cozy because they look all cozy in the White House. And then um, I've quickly decided that instead of that Santa, 
I am going to um, insert a photo that I stole from um, Justine's Instagram account by screenshotting it. And again, I've trimmed it just a little bit smaller so it'll match that other photo and have a 16th of an inch border all the way around. And so this is their photo car card that they got when they entered the party. And of course, I wanted to journal, so I'm going to hide some journaling by just taking a three by four piece of journal paper and attaching um, another stamped holly on there. And that way you can pull it out. And so I'm going to insert those memory protectors back in my album. And here's a look at the album so far. Here's a close up of the pages. And remember to check back for days 11 and 12. And then also, um, the last time I checked, the Days of December is actually available in my online only section of my website. So I'll leave that link below. And you can purchase your own, snap your photos, and you can always scrapbook them once you get the kit. If you have any questions, please leave me a message.